Yes, thank you for telling me I'm alive, Schmitzer. Okay, alright, just fucking with everyone with the fake sound check. I know it's fucking working. Or do I? Dun, dun, dun. Alright, I tested it. Uh, against a level 75 corrupted heavy gunner Eximus. Uh, before I begin, I, I would like some clarification. Under ferrite armor, where it says uh, the symbols and plus plus and negative, uh, does that mean that the ferrite armor is good against the uh, puncture and corrosive damage that it's showing? Or does that mean that you do more damage against it because it's puncture and corrosive? Either way. Uh, before I begin, they're supposed to be weak against corrosive. So instead of those pluses and minuses, it should say ferrite armor, weak against, and then whatever it's weak against, and then it should say strong against, and whatever it's strong against. It should be broken down into two little sections that are easily understood. This plus and minus shit is too ambiguous. Before I even begin. But Prisma Angstrom. Okay, blast and corrosive. This is the previous 100% stat build. I moved the polarity from here to here and took the um, projectile flight velocity off. Blast and corrosive. Alrighty. Just level 75. You know what? Um, little side note. A lot of YouTubers will have the fucking uh, enemies paused. Uh, no. You don't get accurate test results that way. You might get a baseline for, you know, feeling like you're powerful, but no. You know what? I'm, I'm going to decrease the enemy level to something, uh, there we, there we go, level 50. I'm probably never going to see a level 50 unless I go into a sortie, or find a group that'll farm in a uh, survival for, you know, an hour, which is highly unlikely. Well, it didn't one-shot it like it used to at that same level. But one to take the shield down. And the other one to fucking kill it. Right, and what I was doing previous was something absurd. Level 75, which I hardly ever fucking encounter. Oh, about time it did a bit of damage, but still, it's taken a lot. It took all my ammo. And prior to this, you'd see your favorite fucking YouTubers going off and one-shotting shit. What the hell? You know? Just what the actual hell? 
Oh, I might as well go fucking, um, yeah, put that back on as a uh, fucking absurd maxed out. Why the fuck not? Get more well-rounded test results with the... What's going on here? Oh, no, no. <coughs> Knock me down, you fuck. Self damage got him taken away, otherwise I would have blown the fuck up right in there. Oh, that thing is fucking annihilating my health. Another side note, you see him turn on invincibility when they have the enemies unpaused. No such thing with me! Time for that one to be gotten rid of. There's just no way I fucking encounter max level shit. Just organically. Not me. Fuck no. More realistically... Level 60, more realistically for me. Okay, going from that, that used to be 100%, over to this. Oh uh, yeah, that's still blasting corrosive. over 100% and they shouldn't have taken it from 30 down to fucking what was it 24 25 that they put it at no absolutely should not have done that Taking a long time. I ran out of bullets or micro explodey bits, whatever you want to call them. Oh, what? It is taking me significantly more shots to kill these enemies when previously I would just walk in and blow shit up. Like, even, even at level 50, I would just one-shot the living fuck out of shit. Just annihilate it with one not even fully charged shot from this Prisma Angstrom with its previously 100% status build. And yeah, I would see up to level 60 before going into a sortie. Because I would go and fucking do relic farming on survivals, um, defenses, and most notably the excavations.
right? blank configuration. 26%. It went from 30 or so to 26. Ain't that just the fucking tits? So now to get more status, I'm having to sacrifice the amount of damage I'm putting out at base. Because this doesn't have the uh, multi-shot on it that these three give. This just ties, this just ties into make mastery rank mean something. You know, mastery rank 15, you got a four extra slots there. That way I can do the multi-shot and the status build at the same time. And if I want to go above the 60 um, mod capacity, well, I'm going to have to form it like a mother bitch to get everything in now, ain't I? Earn the capacity uh, later on, maybe. I don't fucking know. But give more fucking mod card slots. For fuck's sake. And stop nerfing stuff to begin with. For fuck's sake. Till next time. Fuck right off till next time. I'm a done for now. <laughs>